what are planets that will be the least hostile to us and most interesting to visit out of spectrum of planets and moons? Well, there is a spectrum, but there is just a few that we can land on properly. Of course, Mars and Moon are places that will not kill us upon landing. That is as well why we are currently seriously working on towards landing and living on Mars. But it is known that just with the normal astronaut suit, you can land on them safely. For example, we can't land on Mercury, temperatures are too extreme, from minus 173 Celsius at night to 427 Celsius on the day. Well, how about Venus? Yes, Venus is quite an interesting place, called the Earth's twin because of the similar gravity and size. But just the fact that it is 462 Celsius on average, it is like being in an oven with double the temperature of an oven. And that is not it. The pressure is 90 times the that of Earth, and it is like being one kilometer deep into the Earth's ocean. So then being in an oven would be pretty good. And that is just top reasons for why Venus is simply unreachable. There are even more. So yeah, we are running out of options for good places to land on. But there is a moon on which going to would be quite an interesting adventure. That is Titan, moon of Saturn. It has only 1.5 times the pressure of Earth on the surface, so it is bearable, an atmosphere thicker than our own, with 95% being nitrogen. So it's not deadly, Earth has 70% of it. It just needs oxygen. Also it has gravity similar to our own moon. So all in all conditions are very good. But there is just one problem. Temperature is minus 179 Celsius which we could create a suit to protect us from. So all in all, to be on Titan, it just takes a breathing mask and the protection from the cold. But it is also quite an alive place, with methane and nitrogen lakes on its surface, and islands disappearing and reappearing, and occasional storms and methane rains. So maybe there is something hiding, such as a life form that we have never seen before, relying on methane. This is a place that is worth our time. Now, next is the largest moon in the solar system, Ganymede. As well one of the least hostile places, with an average temperature of minus 113 Celsius and gravity similar to the moon. So, temperature is better than it is on Titan. Interesting thing about Ganymede is that it has a very thin atmosphere, almost non-existent, but it contains mostly just oxygen but we still can't take off our breathing masks off because it is a very insignificant amount and we would still die. So, all it would take to land a Ganymede is a breathing mask and protection from the cold. So, there it is. Ganymede and Titan are as well places in which our future might be, not just Mars. Because over time, we will need to expand to other planets and moons to continue our legacy.